Five Five from Tetra. Check it. channel if you're new here this is Nero and if you've been here thank you thank you thank you so much for always hopping by to my channel and watching my videos yeah and if you're a new subscriber subscribe don't forget to subscribe and you can also share my content to anyone you think is going to help and yeah this video is going to be really really interesting because I'm going to try a new hairstyle yeah this hairstyle I'm there were a few challenges here and there but I did well and I'm excited that I got to do this hairstyle for the first time and it turned out as perfectly as it is it is not perfect but it is something I tried so don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to give me a like you can also comment down below what do you think what do you think thoughts 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 on this new hairstyle that has been trending on YouTube I wanted to try it earlier, but I've been so so busy, busy, busy dealing with a lot of stuff. But finally, here I am. So no further ado, because I feel like I'm talking too much. Let's head to the video. Yeah, I see you try to move slow. If you feel yourself losing all of your control, just breathe. Easy, yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe. Easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe. So for this hairstyle, we are going to be using a needle and a thread. So this thread is 50 shillings at any beauty shop that you go to and this is just 10 shillings. Then another thing before you start doing this hairstyle, make sure your needle is blunt. As you can see, I am capable of doing this without feeling anything or anything. So what I did is I scratched um, the top on a rough surface so that it will be blunt. I have already put in the thread. So most of the stylists I've seen on YouTube have been doing the double thread. Yeah, the double thread. This is the double thread. But I feel like we need to be doing. I feel like I should do the single thread of which this is how you're going to like put in the thread on your needle if you're doing the single thread. So if you're doing the single thread, make sure you have a small strand over here. I'm going to do a double thread. A double thread. You do. A double thread. You just do it like this the normal way. So why I did this at the back? It's because. I want the extension, the center of my extension should be around here. I don't want it at the back, back, back. So if I want the center of my extension to be around um, at this place, Yeah, nigga, 
nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. See what we get easy. No, I breathe these. Easy beat, nice breeze. Got some sick prophecies. I see myself spilling seeds. So it's about to be my season. Fuck a season, deceased, never season. Retreat, take a seat, then it's born up the sea. Feeding your ears on the sickest of flows. They so seasick. Got scriptures, they call me Cassisi. Talking no games, no, no comic, no DC. Is it really love if that shit only skinned? Surrounded by people who don't really see me. Talking by people who won't let me be me. Fucker, my ducker, my go cause a rucker. Say minus the suckers of so fight in the summer. Shining abundance and work on my commas. So you know the boys staying hot like an oven. Yeah, you can hear the wolf howl. Tell me what you gonna do now. Huh? Yeah, I see you trying to move slow. If you feel yourself losing all of your control, just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe. As you saw while we were starting, we did not make a knot. This is because if we do a knot, it's going to make it difficult by taking it out so you're not putting any knots. And also knots will make the front tight and we are avoiding any tension at the front or around the hairline. So for the first few stitches, we are going to do a flat twist because we want the front to be thin as it's going thicker. So you can actually do a flat twist for the first three rounds because it's not going to show as you go on. So after the three rounds, you continue doing your cornrows as I'm going to be showing you guys. So if you noticed, we'll be going from, the motion will be from the right to the center, then from the left to the center, then from the right to the center, from the left to the center, that is the motion that we are going to go with as we do the cornrow. So as you can see guys, the needle is passing under the cornrow to the center, then under the cornrow from the left to the center. So that is the motion that you're going to go with, like I said, from the right to the center, from the left to the center, and that is how we are going to achieve this perfect cornrow. Legacy I'm designed. Yes, sir. Fuck the stress I'm finessing up on the beat. It's my pleasure on many nights. Ain't nobody witnessed the pain. Nobody. I paid my dues. Don't you go get it confused. Yeah. I need to better my views. Yeah. I need some credit yeah. to use. Yeah. 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 yeah, you can hear the wolf howl. Tell me what you gonna do now. So I hope you guys can see and understand how we are doing this cornrow. So it's going to pass under from the right to the center, then under from the left to the center. Those are the motions we are going with as we do this cornrow. It's as easy as that, guys. It's that easy. Passes down from the left to the center, then passes down from the right to the center under the cornrow from the right to the center under the cornrow from the left to the center i hope i have explained it well but that is the best way i could explain it Feeding your ears on the sickest of flows They so seasick, got scriptures, they call me Cassisi Talking no games, no, no comic, no DC Is it really love if that shit only skin deep? Surrounded by people who don't really see me Talking by people who won't let me be me Fucker, my ducker, my go cause a rucker Say minus the suckers of might in the summer Shining abundance and work on my commas So you know the boy staying hot like an oven Yeah, yeah, you can hear the wolf howl. Tell me what you gonna do now. Huh? Yeah, I see you trying to move slow. If you feel yourself losing all of your control, just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. 
let me tell you guys I'm, one thing and i'll be very very honest like if you're going to be doing this thing on yourself be prepared be prepared to be like <laughs> challenged yeah and if you've noticed this side isn't as good as this side but i tried i told you guys this was a trial and error so if i can do it on myself this means i could do it on anyone better yes it's not so bad but this side is just a bomb <laughs> this side is just perfect but this side was a struggle so what you're going to do is i'm going to lay i'm going to lay my edges then i'm going to show you guys my extension that i'm going to be using and all the details i'm supposed to be giving you guys I'll be using this eco styler gel to lay down my edges and the front like we want this style to be neat yes so guys <laughs> so i got this from natural hair kenya like always the other plug and yeah this is the um, the kinky the kinky drawstring extension and this is in the color 1b like, it's so big wow i can't wait to see how i'm going to be looking just just look at it guys just look just look so cute so cute like yo yeah so this is the extension we are going to be dealing with today and before we do that let me just fix my hair at the back this is how the extension looks from inside and i'm just going to turn so that i can show you guys how i'll be putting this on yeah you can hear the wolf howl tell me what you gonna do now yeah i see you trying to move slow Losing all of your control, just breathe, breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe, breathe easy. Yeah, nigga, breathe easy. Just breathe. Guys, I feel amazing. <laughs> I feel so good, and yeah, let me just try and put this extension in place and this hairstyle just turned out like i wanted it to turn out like it's so perfect it's just perfect wow i just love how this extension is full this extension is really 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 full and i love how full it is like hi <laughs> hi <laughs> It's so cute and it's just amazing. Wow. Wow. So guys, let me see if I don't know if I should bring some at the front like that. Okay, the extension is perfect, but I feel like we need to do something something like just lift a little bit of so i want to do some lifting over here so that you can have the extension look like this instead i don't know it looks amazing like this but i feel like i need to have a little bit of hair around there so that it can be more fuller so i'm going to be using my crochet needle to pull some hair at the front yeah you can hear the wolf howl Tell me what you gonna do now Yes you try to move slow If you feel yourself losing all of your control just breathe Easy Okay 
okay so guys we are almost through so i want to accessorize a bit because i feel like it's a bit plain and all that so let me just put let me put some do I breathe these? Yes, sir. Busy beat, as it breeze, got some sick prophecies. I see myself spinning seeds. So it's about to be my season. Yeah. Fuck a season, disease never season. Nah. Retreat, take a seat, then it's born up the sea. Feeding your ears on the sickest of flow. Pros and so cons for these hairstyles so that you guys can like know what you're dealing with in case you want to try this out. And first things first, this is the easiest tutorial for someone who cannot control. Let me not lie. It was complex for me because I was doing it on myself But if you do it on someone or if you get someone to do it for you Then it's going to be easier for you to have this hairstyle done So yeah, one thing if you're going to be doing it yourself And you've not done practice as much It's going to be difficult for you Because yeah, you <laughs> like you've seen my video like this side is not as perfect as this side and you'd want both sides to be perfect so if you really want to have a neat look have someone do it for you or go to the salon and show them a video on this hair salon they can do it for you so another thing is it is painless it is painless it's a very very nice protective hairstyle for anyone with uh, natural hair and can't control this is the best 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 hairstyle because it does not pull your edges another good thing about this hairstyle is the fact that you can do it on any any short hair <laughs> um i don't know if shorter short 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 can work but as i've seen on other people's videos doing this hairstyle like you can do it on short short hair and you'd still have a neat look like you guys you can see let me show you the side that is perfect and which is this side like you guys can see we do not have bumps we do not have hair that is peeping out the yarn is tucking in your natural hair inside so it's so hard for you to see um it's hard for you to see hair peeping out or it's hard for you to see bumps and knots on the way so if you have short hair then you are definitely definitely going to rock this style if you if you've always wanted if you've always wanted to do cornrows and you really can't do cornrows because your hair is really short then this is the style for you just follow the steps and you'll have the perfect cornrows in your life <laughs> let me tell you guys the perfect perfect cornrows in your life so and just like blend this side out i saw another youtuber which was eve or eva mafupa she has a lot of tutorials on the stitch and yarn so if you feel like you've not really really like learned how it's done by me because i'm not also so perfect to this castle because this is my first time trying it out like literally my first time first time trying it out on myself so you can go and watch if mafupa i don't know if i pronounced the last name but if mafupa has tutorials on this hairstyle so what i did with my needle is i blunted it out at the at the tip using a rough surface so i used um i went outside and used a rough surface which was the wall work on practicing on how to do the stitching with the yarn but apart from that it's as easy as you saw me do it it looks complex but trust me if you practice on it you'll be fine after i think uh three rounds or two rounds i guess but don't worry keep on practicing and it will be perfect for you don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to like also you can comment down below what do you think it's going to change your control game because this is the easiest way to control for someone who does not know how to control so let me know in the comment section what you think about this hairstyle um do you think it's easy do you think you can try it out do you comment down below about thoughts on this hairstyle and let me know if i also did well because this is my first time doing it but i feel like i did well only one side was a problem but i managed to hack it so yeah until our next video guys Mwah. bye